What's up everyone? Ron here to introduce an all new exclusive Rockville product. The Rockville RWS 12CA is a slim 1200 watt 12 inch powered car subwoofer enclosure. Rockville has developed and perfected a smart integrated solution for adding bass to any vehicle's audio system. The Rockville slim powered subwoofer combines a subwoofer with matching enclosure and amplifier for optimal bass performance. The RWS 12CA is a sleek, slim looking, heavy duty subwoofer. It has a durable enclosure, monoblock amplifier designed and engineered to work as a complete system resulting in intense bass response. It's also CEA rated at 400 watts and features a quick connect Molex high level input with smart turn on circuitry. The unit easily integrates into any OEM system with minimal wiring. Power, signal, and remote turn-on are achieved via molded angle terminals for easy access allowing for simple setup or removal. The Rockville unit comes standard with a remote bass control, adjustable low-pass crossover, variable bass boost, and 150 millivolt to 5 volt gain control. It also features high-level inputs and RCA connectors for easy integration with nearly any factory or aftermarket head unit. Slim profile, these loaded enclosures are perfect for car trunks and for behind or under pickup truck seats that hug the back of the cab. The units are the smallest sub boxes designed by Rockville, but don't let their small size fool you. They're ready to explode with high power, super intense bass, and extraordinary SPL levels. By taking all the groundbreaking technology from the Rockville shallow mount T3 subwoofers, producing real head pounding bass, combined with a true carpeted MDF box enclosure, and Rockville class leading monoblock amplifier, these diminutive enclosures are perfect for placement anywhere in any vehicle. So save space in your trunk or hatch with the Rockville all-in-one drop-in base solution and still have plenty of hauling space. In this video, we're going to break down our all-new color optic speakers and subwoofers that are designed to light the way. Whether you're building a system in a pontoon, weightboard, fishing boat, or a multi-zone system in a sport yacht, take your audio to the next level with our next generation of marine speakers and subwoofers. At Rockford Fallsgate, we're meticulous about sound quality, and these new speakers and subwoofers are the best sounding models, purpose built for marine audio. We built them to be element ready, which gives these speakers protection against salt, water, dust, and harmful UV rays, so they won't fade or deteriorate. Once you hear their rich full sound, you'll wonder what you've been missing before. Best of all, they're designed and engineered right here in Tempe, Arizona. Now, let's take a look at the lineup and we'll dive into the features. There are three series in our Marine Audio line. The top of the line M2 series ranging from a 1-inch tweeter, full range 6.5, 8-inch, and a 10-inch subwoofer. Our M1 series ranging from a 6-inch speaker up to a 12-inch subwoofer. And the M0 series, our base model, is a 6.5 full range speaker set. All models are available in black and in white. Let's start by talking about our M0 6.5 inch full range that features a half inch tweeter. We've optimized the output, allowing them to be used with or without an amplifier. These offer the same great features as our M1 and M2 models, but without the illumination. The M1 speakers feature high power handling, improved sound, and our new Color Optics LED lighting system. The M1 uses a large 1 inch tweeter, contributing to a wide frequency response. So regardless if you're using source unit power or an external amplifier, you'll get loud, clear, accurate sound. Tie your true marine ecosystem together with integrated Deutsch and Amphenol connections for industry leading plug and play connectivity. So your wiring always stays dry in wet marine environments. Coolest of all, set the mood with your own color experience with our new optional Color Optics plug and play controller. Check it out with the Apple and Android app you can change colors in real time. The M1 subwoofers employ the same Deutsch and Amphenol connectors along with the color optics capability while including a new Versa switch for wiring both voice coils in series or parallel. This will allow you to properly match the subwoofers to the amplifier just by flipping a switch. 
Step up to the M2 speakers that take your audio to the next level with stronger motors, more power handling, and configurable grills. By doubling the voice coil layers, Rockford Fosgate made the M2 the loudest coaxial marine speaker. And the stronger motor structure means double the power handling. So they're designed to work with the most powerful of amplifiers. The speakers also include a stainless steel grill option. Simply remove the grill insert and install the stainless mesh. This gives you two totally different aesthetics, allowing you to match the audio system to your environment. The M2 subwoofers include all the same great features you just saw, including the Versa switch for ease of wiring, stainless steel grill option, but with an enclosureless design. These models are optimized for infinite baffle systems for loud, low frequency bass without constraining you to complex enclosures. We also have an add-on one inch tweeter kit compatible with all M1 and M2 speaker systems. Simply connect it into the extra spade terminals on the back. This will give your system more output so you can hear your music clearly, regardless of the marine conditions. In this video, we highlighted the features and benefits of our new color optic speakers. For more info and features, detailed specs and pricing, please check out our website at rockfordfosgate.com. If you need additional help, use our live chat or give us a call at 1-800-669-9899. We'll see you again in the next video. Hi guys, I'm Steve Brown, coming at you from the world famous Alpine Beat Laboratory. And today we're gonna to show you our brand new, budget-friendly baseline subwoofers. Now the baseline subs were born from a collaboration between Alpine and the popular hip hop group Far East Movement. Now, Far East Movement's music features fun, high energy beats with deep bass undertones. And the group worked with Alpine's engineers to give input on the qualities that they wanted in the SWA subwoofers. They actually named the subwoofers bass line to pay homage to the power and the infectious energy that bass brings to music. Now, the bass line subs come in two models. The SWA 12S4, that's the 12 inch single uh, forum voice coil. That's the sub that you see here. We also make the SWA 10S4 10 inch single forum sub. Now each sub is capable of handling 250 watts RMS or 750 watts of peak power. Here are some of the features that make Baseline so powerful and reliable and we're going to show you each one of these as we go through. First is the patent pending progressive wavelet ribs, that's kind of hard to say, PWR, cone for maximum structural rigidity. So that makes the cone stiff and light and that contributes to good low power efficiency. Okay. Polypropylene and mica damped cone assembly for great sounding low bass tones. A high strength steel frame that keeps the distortion low because it keeps everything where it's supposed to be in the woofer. A two piece yoke with vented pull piece. That means the air moves over the voice coil, keeping the voice coil cool even at high output. And a high excursion polyfoam surround. That lets the cone move. The more the cone moves, the more bass that you get. And a progressive polyester spider. That gives you accurate control of the woofer cone during those high excursion events. On the back, you've got eight gauge push terminals because you know you want to run nice heavy gauge power wire into these subwoofers for a good installation. And brand new cosmetics. They feature the baseline logo, which is printed in a nice matte silver, and then a raised Alpine logo on the rim trim ring of the woofer as well. And of course, 10 millimeters of X-Max. That means that they can move enough air to move your hair. Now, baseline subs were designed to work in both sealed and ported enclosures, giving you maximum installation flexibility. So for a compact installation, a small three quarter cubic foot box is all the 10 inch baseline needs and the 12 inch needs about one cubic foot. But if you really want to get the most out of baseline, go for a ported enclosure. You want 1.5 cubic feet tuned to 40 hertz for the 10 and 1.9 cubic feet tuned to 37 hertz for the 12. Now, since Far East Movement helped create Baseline, the group is going to actively promote these great woofers throughout the year. The first thing you're going to see is a set of viral videos focused on the group's custom and very cool 1984 Cadillac limo, because how cool is an 80s Cadillac limo? So stay tuned for those. Hey everyone, and welcome back. In this product video, we're going to be looking at a new addition to the Terminator family of products, the TN8 MS Amplified Micro Sub Enclosure. Now, you probably know us best for being a leader in big bass, but you may find yourself in a scenario where big woofer boxes are more than you need, or you may not have any space for. This is where the TNA MS 
comes in. Its compact size allows for its installation into tight spots such as under a seat in a car or behind the seat in a truck. To provide a more secure mount for the enclosure, we also include hold-down plates that help lock the enclosure to the vehicle's mounting surface that you choose. Now, of course, just because it's a compact design doesn't mean it's limited on its capabilities. Now, of course, we know there are a lot of the underseat subs on the market already, but our engineering group has refined and improved our final design to deliver the best output possible for the space allowed. Now, one element in this is the chassis of the enclosure itself. We use a high density, all aluminum chassis to reduce any resonant energy loss that could basically rob you of base output. This additionally acts as a heat sink for both the woofer and integrated amplifier, providing for a large surface area to help dissipate heat buildup and improve the efficiency of both. The amplifier is a high efficiency class AB design, which accepts eight gauge power and ground inputs, integrated controls that allow you to change the phase of the woofer to best align it with the rest of the speakers in the audio system, as well as a variable gain control, variable bass boost, and adjustable crossover with settings between 50 and 150 hertz. Signal inputs can be provided through the integrated RCA connections with activation provided by a remote turn-on wire or through a high-level speaker wire connection using the supplied wire harness. Now, using high-level inputs allows you to turn the unit on through signal sensing via the speaker wire connections. This eliminates the need of locating a separate turn-on signal when tying into a factory audio system. The final connection found on the unit is for an external base control. Now this control is included in the box and allows you to have remote level control over the output of the woofer. Connection is made by simply plugging in the 3.5 millimeter connector into the jack provided and the remote is ready to go. Simply mount the control and you're ready to enjoy your new enclosure. Now the amplifier output is rated at 135 watts RMS and 200 watts dynamically. Now this rating is done using the new CTA 2006C standard, which is a much more stringent testing standard than the predecessor 2006B. The CTA standards were created to provide legitimate manufacturers a balanced standard to test their amplifiers too. This allows you, the consumer, to know exactly what you're getting in an amplifier. Now, many companies will put unrealistic power numbers on their amplifiers that they would never even be able to achieve. And of course, this can cause a number of issues on both the manufacturing as well as consumer side. So to ensure you're getting a quality amplifier, make sure you only buy units tested to the CEA 2006 standards like our TN8MS. Well, this wraps up our first look at the TN8MS Amplified Sub-Enclosure, and I thank you for joining me. As always, remember to subscribe to our YouTube channel to see what's going on in the world of MTX, as well as getting the latest new product videos. Also, follow us on Facebook and Instagram for daily updates with what we're up to and where we'll be, so you can always come by and see us and say hi. Thanks again for stopping by, and as always, I'll see you again in the next video. The HS8 Hideaway has been massively successful for Kicker for many years, so we challenged our team of engineers to come up with the next big thing, or should I say little thing. What they came up with is called the Hideaway HS10. The HS10 improves over the HS8 by adding more power, 180 watts versus 150, and a larger woofer, 10 inch versus 8 inch. And it's almost the same size as the HS8, in fact, if you already have an HS8, like I do my Mazda CX-5, you can actually unplug the harness from the 8 and install the 10 and you're done. Super, super simple. The improvements of the 10 versus the 8, obviously more cone area, more power, but in addition, we have increased the input voltage for the high level input. If you've got a truly high powered factory installed audio system, but you still need more bass, the high-level inputs will accept up to 40 volts, which is the equivalent of 400 watts at 4 ohms. 
So almost any high-powered factory installed audio system can go straight into the HS10 and you'll have great bass response. In addition, we have what's called DC offset. That means the amplifier in the hideaway will turn itself on and off with the car. So you don't have to go tr find, trying to find a switched ignition lead. This simplifies your install dramatically. So what if you've got an aftermarket radio with RCA outputs? Well, we've got a simple addition for that as well. The KISL simply takes your RCA output and converts it to speaker level output. So the HS10 can be easily added to your aftermarket radio as well. Included with the HS10 is a remote bass knob. So if you want to dial back the bass or bump it up, you can do that remotely from your dash. Very simple installation, great bass response, take a factory system and make it incredible, or even upgrade an aftermarket system as well. So whatever you need, great bass, small package, HS10 hideaway. <laughs>